Then lost a titan of business and sport this weekend. Kohler Company Executive Chairman Herb Kohler passed away Saturday. He was 83. Bruce Harrison shares with us Kohler's visit, or I'm sorry, Kohler's vast impact on Southeast Wisconsin, the state, and the country. For many people, the Kohler Company and Herb Kohler's contributions to it are a way of life. As long as I can remember, it's always been a fabric of this community, whether it's friends, family, working for the company itself. Born and raised here, Sheboygan Mayor Ryan Sorensen says Kohler is synonymous with Sheboygan. Herb had a big heart uh, for, for this community and his company um, and definitely cared about making an impact. Kohler ran the company for 43 years, expanding from plumbing fixtures to include power systems. Annual revenue surged under Kohler to about six billion dollars. Herb Kohler's father established this village, Kohler, Wisconsin, but it was the son who truly transformed it over the years, developing the Kohler Design Center as well as the hospitality arm Destination Kohler, a destination for world-class golf. How big was Herb Kohler's impact on golf in this state? It was huge. I, I think he was probably the most important or influential figure in Wisconsin golf history. Gary Diamato with Golf Wisconsin interviewed Kohler for decades. He uh, he attracted the golf world to our doorstep, really. Before he built Black Wolf Run and Whistling Straits, Wisconsin was a flyover state for traveling golfers. Um, that's definitely no longer the case. TMJ4's Lance Allen sat down with Kohler last year when he brought the Ryder Cup to his Whistling Straits in little Sheboygan County. It's an honor beyond words to host this uh, golf tournament. It's Sam Ryder really created something in 1927. This is just another step in the way and we hope to make it equal to or better than Paris, Rome or New York, which are gathered around us. Kohler, Wisconsin will show them all. Reporting in the village of Kohler, Bruce Harrison, TMJ4 News.